All right, Sag Savix disconnect. So I have not seen Savix's pov. So, okay, so this is Savix. He's going into his duel. Obviously, he's very locked in. He's eating. He saps Sidu. He resaps Sidu. Sidu. Like, this is really close. Hold on, so let me pause. If you're Savix here, Sidu is at 48% with 21% mana. And, you know, you have grenades. What? Let's see, you have... Are these sappers? You have... Magic dust. Uh, do we have arcane bombs? Let's see. T's on cooldown. Vanish is on cooldown. Preps on cooldown. So, so Savix at this moment does have title charm. No vanishes. No prep. But he he can open up a cheap shot into a kidney into a title charm, and Stadman's fifty percent life with no mana. Okay, so let's watch. So I'd say like Savix is in a really great spot. Log in. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is so painful. Oh, and he logs. Do I just play? What is this? Yeah, you have to play. Oh, that's so brutal. So I haven't seen it from Savix's Pov. I didn't. Dude, this looks like. Sidu's <sighs> dead here, isn't he? Does anyone think Sidu lives here? Oh, he's dead, isn't he? Oh, man. I didn't realize, like, from the caster pov, I didn't realize when the disconnect happened, right? I didn't know, uh, like, the exact specifics here, and I didn't realize, like, the cooldown situation. The Goblin Rocket Helm used, and that's gonna be the reset Savix needs. This is, this is very close. Savix is gonna sit and stealth for a second and eat... Uh, back up some HP, going for the half diminishing return Sapir, opening up with a cheap shot just to build combo points. Gonna go for another restealth. Savix praying that there's no heartbeat break here. Sidu low on mana, but I think this duel is kind of going Sidu's way. Another immolation or a use that might knock him out. Lesser healing wave being casted. Does it knock him out? Does Savix. Did he disconnect? What? Oh no! What, what, what's he doing? Oh no, no, it was the, uh, the totem. The totem. Uh, but did he, did he not? Out. He just wasn't yeah. moving. Savix, he wasn't moving. He's what so happened? low. That might be it. Oh, That's another DC'd. tuber. Savix wants here today. He's down to 20%, but gets a nice big major healing potion back up to half. Kind of energy starved, and it looks like Damn. he goes down. See you. Savix goes down. Guys, can we get some Fs in the chat for Savix? I mean, my man was robbed. It, it, my man was robbed by the servers or the add-ons or whatever the hell did that. Do I just play? What is this? Like, that sucks. I didn't even realize it went down like this from my pov. That sucks. It really does. Where I've got to, like, reach out to Sav and just be like, I'm sorry, bro. His phase too. Like, you you know how much time he put into this, right? He put in... I, I wonder what his slash plate is. It's probably, like, five days, six days, seven seven days, eight days slash plate, something like that. Can I see c pov? Yeah, does anyone have c pov of this exact moment? Goose are cleaving nucleus? I'm gonna cleave your ass, bro. Whoa, this is not the clip we were looking for. We're, we're looking for the Sidu perspective. Oh yeah, soon they will come in the ass too, won't they? Twitch. Is, is, is this thing on? We're, we're looking for Sidu's perspective into Savix. Oh, that doesn't sound right either. We're looking for Sidu's perspective when he's dueling Savix. Is that better? Esther's thought you let the duel reset. No, I just couldn't really chase him. Oh my God. Oh my God. So this he is in stealth. Yeah, so Sidu probably didn't know because Savix was stealthed. Oh no. Oh, so Sidu had no idea. Ah. Oh May get it. We need those W. Do I just play? Yeah. So from my pov, what I thought happened is Savix didn't open let C do bandage, and then the immolation aura ticks Savix out. So I had no idea there was a disconnect, and I had no idea that um, that he, you know, when he logged in, he was out of stealth. I, I just thought I just thought the immolation hit him, he waited too long, and that was it. Dude, from my POV, I couldn't tell if he didn't realize I knocked him out of stealth or not. I couldn't tell if right. he didn't... Like, it, w it, was re it looked really awkward. But I had oil of immolation up, and I knocked him out of stealth. And oh, I was like, does he not know I knocked him out of stealth? 
Like... That's what I thought. From the caster pov, I thought the uh, aura of immolation knocked him. So I thought Sidu just outplayed him. I didn't see the disconnect happen at all. Dude, Savix's whole chat just spams to fucking eat his ass. Is that, is that his thing? Does Savix actually eat ass? FK comp. I was M under prepped. No engineering or enchant. That's disgusting. I'd cow I even qualified. Um, I'm still, I still want to see Sidu's pov of like when it actually... Oh, here it goes. Someone linked it. Thanks, uh, John in the chat. All right, so Sidu sapped. He he's spamming immolation aura, and then it gets him out. So Sidu had no idea. Sidu wouldn't have any idea because Savix was in stealth when the disconnect happened. The immolation aura hits him out, and he's standing still. And from my perspective as a caster, and from Sidu's perspective, it kind of looks like Savix took his hands off the keyboard for a second because. You know, he's in stealth. He didn't think he was going to get hit. He didn't maybe think the heartbeat was going to break the sap or whatever. And then he comes Good. back right there. So he only, like, was gone for, like, a sec. It almost just looks like Savix was AFK a second and didn't realize he got hit out. That's what I thought. That's what Sidu thought. That's what Fan thought. So everyone thought he kind of just, you know, stood still for half a second. But it really, it yeah, it really lost him the duel. It really lost him the duel there. That makes DC. C2 feels a bit bad, but. Right here. So, right here, it was like, okay, well, C2 could chase, but how, like, how? You have crippling for six seconds. I guess he could elixir and ghost wolf, but he's going to get a restealth no matter what. What am I supposed to do here? Yeah, so he just decides to drink. So, as casters, we were getting the info, Savix disconnected, and then we saw this. So, we're like, okay, um, Sidu's being a good sport and drinking to full and letting Savix get back to full. Um, but it was really more like Sidu, uh, after watching this back, he's like, I can't chase, so I might as well drink. I see. Okay. So, I was mistaken yesterday. Swapping gear sets. And then the clip ends. And then, yeah, so we know how it happens. Uh, Savix reopens. But C2 is full health, full mana, no vanishes, no blinds, no cooldowns. So C2, of course, wins. Man, it just, yeah, really, really bad situation there. So this was the mages, uh, the mage he was supposed to fight in round one. He didn't show up, so Snut's got to buy. Like he. Let's go, baby, let's go. So he duels him to the death after last night. So he's gonna mock or all him after. One last duel. Let's go. Might as well. I mean, it's a mage duel too, so Snut feels probably pretty confident into the mage. I don't want to skip because I don't know when it happens. So let's just watch it. Easy extra ears. True, bro. Snut has five ears, and if he wins this, obviously it's sick. So he'll have some of the most ears of anyone in the world after this journey. Pretty cool. Oh man, from the lock pop, it just looks so good. You just pop that curse of tongues. Killing the pet. Tidal charming him. Full fear. Mechanical dragonling's dead. Fakes the CS into the refear. Alt Z. Oh, I wonder if Alt Z's would disconnected him. Okay, bro, you should un Alt Z. What the hell's going on, man? Oh my gosh. He's gonna Alt Z the whole thing? Bro, it's not. <laughs> I w that's ballsy. Obviously, the mage has done much. He's yeah, he he on alt for a sec. Yeah, I would have done the same thing. I don't I don't want to skip because I don't know when it happens. Let's just keep watching. Bro is locked in. Yeah, bro, it's nuts. Is alt Z a known DC factor? I don't think so. Thanks for the commentary. I'm just glad you guys enjoyed. Alt C is the ultimate BM. Yeah, I mean, Am I winning? it's a pretty warlock favored matchup. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna skip a little bit. Well, I don't know. <sighs> <laughs> he disconnects. Oh my gosh, he actually disconnects in a Makara. And he logs back in, still alt seed. 
it doesn't even matter it, like that's how one like bro people are uh, <laughs> people are confused about this matchup that's how one-sided this is the warlock can literally disconnect log out and log in and still be like super favored because what's the mage gonna do like when the warlock disconnects the dots are still ticking the pet is still going hard the mage casts like a frost bolt or two and the warlock probably just resisted him anyway so the warlock's even further ahead after the disconnect pika's reaction to sony's close call okay yeah, no. oh bro what okay. pika's looking good in the suit look at the fresh fade the pushback the button up look oh my gosh my man pika looking good dude Cleanse. Whirlwind. We have war stop. We're so fucking low. Oh my god! Ah! Oh, the war stop. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Holy shit! It doesn't get any closer, lady. That, this was my favorite duel of the day. And you know what? It, you know what's so cool is uh, everyone was giving Sony flack for going Torin, including myself, and he wins from the war stomp. Like the 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 war stomp won it for him. Like in the clutch, he's like about to die. Oh my god! And he war stomps <laughs> into an execute. Like the war stomp actually won it for him. Sticking to his guns wins him that matchup and the five percent max health definitely. But like, oh, that's so cool.